I need answers now. Okay, okay. This is how it all started. Where's Rosalind? She's over there, man. Who's that? What's your name? It's Juliet. You know what the shirt's made of? What? Boyfriend material. Oh my god, Juliet. Your mom needs you, like, right now. Okay, what is up? I walk into this party and see you with this fine boy. What about Paris? Okay, okay. I don't even know what happened, if you know what I mean. I just fell in love with this guy named Romeo. Uh-huh. You're funny. That's not even possible. You can't just fall in love that quick. You don't understand. You've never felt this way before. If you're so in love with him, why don't you just marry him? You know what? That's actually not a bad idea. I need to get married tomorrow. Wait, what? You heard me. Oh. Romeo? Are you Juliet's special someone? Yeah, that's me. I was just wondering when you wanted to arrange the wedding day. I'm down for tomorrow at 9. Sounds good. I'll tell Juliet. And you may now kiss the bride. I just got married! Mercutio, it's time to die! Oh, no! A plague on both your houses. Benvolio, what happened here? Timbal killed Mercutio. So, Romeo killed Timbal. I hereby declare Romeo is banished from Verona Park. What do I do? Don't worry, I have a plan. Just stay in Mantua and I'll figure out the rest. Alright, thanks, Mom. Hello? Don't panic, Juliet, okay? Your father has arranged a marriage with Paris in two days. What are you saying? I can't marry Paris. I'm already married to Romeo. Okay, fine. But I'm just saying, you just need to move on. Juliet, I have an idea. Take this medicine and it will make you fall asleep for 48 hours. In the meantime, people will think you're dead and me and Romeo will be waiting at your tomb. What if the drug actually hurts me? Trust me, take it the day before your wedding. Okay. By the way, you're getting married tomorrow. Juliet's dead. Take me to Verona. Okay. Alright, thanks. See ya. Excuse you, even in death. Why didn't you stop him? I sent him the message, but it probably didn't deliver. Leave me. And that's all I know. You have the right to remain silent. Anything you say can and will be used against you in a court of law.